dear friends we are going to have a brief introduction about uh, screencast o matic software and uh, we are now we are going to see how to prepare a video for our lab uh, demonstrations and procedures so in this case i want you to go to google search and type for screen and search for screen screencast o matic so once uh, the search results are displayed and so please go to the screencast o matic website So now you can find the option for start recording here. So please click the start recording options, so which will give you take you to another page where you have two options. One is for launch recorder, another one is for the Go Pro. So for in case of Pro, you have many of many advantages. So but for our cases, first we are going to try only with that free package that is available for recording our videos. So please click the launch recorder recorder. Uh, option and once you click that one it will start downloading the uh, screencast o matic package software and it automatically launch the recorder and you can see a uh, recorder option open on your desktop automatic in the record option that opens automatically in your desktop you can see a page like this so this shows the outer uh, boundaries of your video page so whatever that is available within this limit is going to be recorded as my video it is going to be available for my students to see that so here you can see a black box available so in the black box you can see three options one is a screen so the other second one is shares a webcam and the third one that includes a screen and a webcam if you want to record only the uh, materials that are only that are materials that are visible only in a screen if you want to record the materials that are available only in a screen so please click the screen option only and if you want to give a live lecture and if you want to show some practical demonstrations please click the webcam and if you want to have a both so you can go for that one in which case you can see the powerpoints or any other content that are available in the desktop as well as the webcam both are available and i believe for the free package what we are going to use that now so this option is not going to be available so for our case uh, to start with um, so i want you to click that screen option so once the screen option is selected so your screen will be that so then the next thing is you have to choose the boundary so the area which you want to record so choose you can expand as contrast the boundary so once the boundary is ready so boundary boundary is ready keep your powerpoints or pdf or video files which you want to record it as a video in your desk uh, ready in your desktop so ready in your desktop and then we can start the recording options now i want to display my powerpoint explanations for my class so here you can see so that i have a powerpoint file for c programming so c pro programming so uh, whatever that is visible or whatever that is within the limits of the boundary I have selected is going to be visible to you also and is going to be visible to our students in future. So now I am going to the uh, slideshow option. So you can go to the uh, slide source. You can move each and every slides. You can explain each and every steps or content in every slide. So each and every and you can go for any number of slides. But the limit is the maximum record time is 15 minutes for this uh, video recording option so that is available for free so you can go to that uh, slides you can go for any options and if you, there is an edit option that is available below and if you want to draw if you want to draw anything so you can also uh, draw like this so you can uh, you can show some highlights some important points or any or, or all these options are available so to explain a powerpoint so now and if you want to change to a pdf file so you can open the pdf file that is readily available in your desktop you can open the pdf file that is readily available in your desktop so you can have a book or any content materials you can scroll over it you can explain each and every material that are available so even if it is in in a word format also whatever that is displayed in your desktop is alone is going to be recorded along with your voice 
and again if you want to record a video open a video file that is available or kept readily uh, readily in your desktop so now you can play the video this video will also be recorded along with the first point along with the video along with the one So in this way, either you can play with, a, you can explain with a PowerPoint, or you can play a video, or you can explain with a PDF or a Word file, anything along with your voices, or along with your voice. So once the recording is over, just click the stop button that is available below your, your screen, and once the stop button is clicked, so you can, uh, that is an option to go for uh, done. So that is an option available as done that is available in the same board where the record and stop buttons are available and you can click the done button so the record will be recording will be over then so once done is clicked so automatically go to an another uh, it will give an another option whether to publish or not so you can you can click as uh, save as video and then click publish so the video will be saved and published and will be will, will be available in a VLC form. So I believe this will be useful to you for your laboratory classes. Thank you.